Notice lots of people out there on the sands, but they're not baking out there. It feels oh so comfortable out there. Temperatures still this afternoon only into the upper 70s right now. We have a north wind fluctuating at around 10 to 15 miles per hour. That's dragging in cooler, less humid air. So you notice that dew point of 66 in Miami. It feels much more comfortable as that north wind continues to drag in that very refreshing air towards South Florida. Notice no rain on the radar. We are nice and dry thanks to that cold front that is now just to the south of the keys. That north wind behind this cold front is going to continue to bring that cooler air into South Florida. So we're talking temperatures as cool as the upper 50s possible later on this week. High temperatures today only getting a few degrees higher than what we have now in the low to mid 80s. It's going to feel fantastic. That north wind is going to continue for the rest of the day on the breezier side of things, so it'll feel very refreshing this afternoon, and that is going to bring some cooler temperatures overnight. So forecast morning lows for tomorrow. We're going to expect low to mid 60s across the urban corridor. Miami 65, Fort Lauderdale could be right around 60, maybe upper 50s. Upper 50s are expected near I-75 and down towards the Turnpike extension as well, with temperatures in the upper 60s and low 70s into the lower keys. All thanks to this building high pressure that's going to be moving into the southeast by your Tuesday, providing for that northwesterly wind. Now we're going to be cooler, but the clouds will linger on the backside of this front for tomorrow, so we'll see a mix of sun and clouds. We're going to be extremely sunny as we head towards Wednesday as those clouds finally shift down towards the south. And with high pressure building in a little bit closer to the state of Florida, Wednesday morning is going to be even cooler than what we expect on Tuesday morning. We're going to expect mid to upper 50s for our inland neighborhoods right along the coastline upper 50s to low 60s. So this is going to be the coolest air that we have seen this entire season. So far we've only had one cold front this entire season since October started and that was October 17th with a temperature of 63 degrees. Now for forecast morning lows on Wednesday we're doing upper 50s to about 60. So that would be the coolest temperature that we have seen so far this fall. On your seven day forecast, Christy, you'll notice it has a little bit of staying power. We have upper 50s to low 60s Tuesday, Wednesday, even Thursday with temperatures into the mid and upper 70s. Mix of sun and clouds and for this weekend temperatures in the mid 80s with a lot of sunshine.